and it stands for everybody's not doing it. And our goal is to prevent at-risk behaviors in preteen and teen youth. Uh, we want them to feel loved when they come to our environment. So that's going to be the number one value that we teach and that we share with our youth. I like about coming to end is that you're surrounded with a whole bunch of kids that have the same morals and values that you have. So in a world full of questionable people to hang around with, you're just surrounded by a good group of kids that you know you can communicate with, and they come from a lot of different walks of life. That your organization is not about just helping the kids; it's also about helping the adults too. So, and you are also part of my family. I just, just like how everybody's pretty much a big family, and we all get along, and we're all close with each other. To where they feel safe, uh, they feel like they have. Um, worth and they, they love being there and they, they have fun so we want to really create a fun environment where the youth can come and just feel like uh, this is home for them. And it had a real positive impact on my kids. Um, they, they created a community for you know so my kids can learn and grow through um, a Christian environment, mm -hmm. a safe environment, positive influence. Which is um, and not just for the sake of numbers but I believe that there are other teams out there who could benefit from um, the platform and the tools and the resources that it has simply to tell them the truth about the negative influences of the popular culture. Um, all popular culture is not bad, but they need to know how to discern the truth from a lie and the messages that they're getting.